Good morning, good morning, good morning. Lisa here. This is Lisa 6 and 3, and here is God's strength for you this day. Our scripture reading is coming from 2 Peter um, 1, starting at 5. But also this very reason, giving all diligence, add to your faith, virtue, to virtue, knowledge, to knowledge, self-control, to self-control, perseverance, to perseverance, godliness, to godliness, brotherly kindness, and to brotherly kindness, love. For if these things are yours and abound within you, you will be neither barren nor unfruitful in the knowledge of our Lord Jesus Christ. For he who lacks these things is short-sighted even to the blindness and has forgotten that he was cleansed from his old sins. Therefore, because of this, brethren, be even more diligent to make your call and election sure. For if you do these things, if you make your calling and election sure based on the therefore, you will never stumble. For so an entrance will be supplied to you abundantly into the everlasting kingdom of our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ. Now, this passage of scripture, we hear a lot, not just in the church, but just random. Make your calling and election sure. But why are we making our calling and election sure? What are we comparing it to? And here Peter says, therefore, and the therefore is this, knowledge, self-control, virtue, brotherly kindness, which leads to brotherly love. And you will be fruitful. You won't be barren. You will have the knowledge of Jesus Christ. That's what it's saying. Growing in the knowledge. When you've made your calling and election sure, you're walking in the therefore. And if you don't remember what the therefore is, go to 2 Peter chapter 1 and read the therefore. Today's strength. Are you walking in the therefore? Are you walking in virtue? Are you growing in your knowledge of the kingdom? Are you growing in the knowledge of brotherly love? Are you growing in the knowledge? Mm. Therefore, make your calling and election sure. If you're not walking in the knowledge of Jesus Christ. Mm. That's a good word. Are you growing in the therefore? Mm. Now, ooh, that was good. That was good. That was good. Thank you, Lord. Are you growing in the therefore? Mm. This has been Lisa with Lisa, 6 and 3. You go. Make it a wonderful day. And I will see you tomorrow morning. Be blessed.